kind of life on their own. Mm -hmm. Yeah. I thought of another magic trick that I know. Oh yeah. Let's see. All right. Huh? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. That's amazing. Can we build the pyre out in the parking lot? This is this this cannot stand. Oh, sorry. Oh. Mm -hmm. We have a video. We do have a video. Yeah. We have many videos, in fact. This, but this one specifically, they're not telling me what it is. Oh, I suppose because it hasn't happened yet. Another one. Time Hunters. Oh. Time Hunters, episode four. Come sail away. Time date. Orange banana mocha latte. Wait, hold on. That's my drink order. Anyways, these are the voyages of the timeship Mufikins the Cat. Our continuing mission is to save the producer and remove Jerry from the show. I hate you, Jerry. We are currently being attacked by parasailing time bandits, though. I blame Chris. You promised we were actually going to go save the producer. And we are! I couldn't have predicted time bandits. Who could predict time bandits? It's a direct quote. Hey, look, time bandits. We should go see what they're doing. Yeah, I was trying to be friendly. You wrote time bandits are salad eaters on the front of the ship. They're vegans. I thought they liked healthy eating. And why did you bite your thumb at them as you flew by? I thought one of them had lettuce stuck in their teeth. I was just trying to be helpful. Well, try to keep your helpful attitude to a minimum, right? At least no one got hurt. Jerry lost an arm. He's got another one. Nothing important. All fine. Time Hunter's Guidebook, Section 4, Paragraph 2. Every crew member is important to your mission, no matter how insignificant and useless they may seem. Read the addendum. I know the addendum. Addendum 123, paragraph 2, applies only to non-red shirt wearing crew members. I don't see how that applies in the slightest. Jerry's shirt is red. Now it is. Exactly. I think you're being very liberal with your interpretation. Don't get all political with me, number two. Number two? Poop joke. Oh, you're so immature. Time date. Broccoli ginseng smoothie. Ugh, I did it again. Whatever. Another successful mission for the timeship Mufikins the Cat. Only the temporal stream knows where we will end up next in our search for the producer. I have just so many questions. And they will all be answered because, ladies and gentlemen, and anyone in between, Time Hunters is going to be a real thing moving forward. Check us out on them, their internets, because it's going to be a new show with adventure and time okay. problems. Calm down there, Skiffy. All right, fair enough. Yeah. yeah. I, what was time I wearing? Time Hunters. What, what was I wearing? Uh, well, uh, you see, I need to ensure that I have a backup beard, uh, so we attached uh, just a couple of uh, epithelial skin cells uh, just along the outside of your jawline, and it uh, yielded some really exciting results. As far as beard transfers are concerned, we have got this locked down. Is that where those extra chest hairs came from? Well, yeah, we needed to do a culture sample first to make sure that your cells would accept the, uh, the instructions, and now that we know that it does, we will have done it very soon, and that beard looked amazing. I thought I was turning werewolf. What did you do? Okay, but the thing Let's about, go to a break. The thing about lycanthropy is that it's a really useful way of affecting gene sequences, right? So, like, much like...